Hey everybody, my name is Jeremiah Craig and I'm coming at you from Pete's Clothing and Western Wear in Belfouche, South Dakota. And I found a boot here that is incredible. This is an Anderson Bean Black Cayman Belly Boot. I'm so excited to get into this one, so let's get into it. I'm just here to connect ya And then I'll be on my way all right, Pete's here in Belfouche is amazing. They have so many different styles. Anderson Bean, Rio, so Mercedes, Tony Lama, Hondo, Ariat, and many are special to just this store. So I would highly recommend you calling them, seeing what they have. They'll send you pictures. Um, it's an incredible store. If you're ever passing through nearby, like it's worth a trip out of your way to come to this store. They had this Anderson Bean, which I hadn't had a chance to try one yet because you guys know that uh, I live back east. Anderson Bean isn't in that area. So now that I'm in South Dakota, I had to keep my eye out for one. It was here at Pete's and there's a lot about this boot that just looks incredible. So let's break it down and get into the rundown. This is Anderson B model number S3005 and it features black Cayman belly on the foot and the shaft and it's a really supple Cayman too. It feels great. It also has a wide square toe with a double stitch welt. The Anderson Bean toe shape is really unique to just them. It kind of tapers a little bit. The Rio Stone Mercedes is the same thing. Very unique toe shape. You can tell what it is right away. It stands at 13 inches tall and it features what Anderson Bean is calling black glove leather and it is glove soft. This stitch pattern in here is beautiful too. I love the tan orange and red that they got going on here and that red piping up the side is beautiful as well. Down here we have a bonded leather heel. So this is a way that they keep the price down of their US made boots. They are using a composite leather, which is similar to what particle board would be, but for leather, they're using scraps and things to mix it with glue and then create a leather composite here, which they're building this heel on. On the outsole, it is a beautiful leather and a traditional construction down here with wood pegs alongside that shank. Love the look of this. On the inside, it is a very soft cowhide leather all the way through on the shaft and the foot and for an insole, you have a couple of options. You can leave the insole that they have in there, which is a foam insole with a little lined cloth top there. And underneath that is a traditional construction, a hard leather insole, which, you know, I love to see. I would probably prefer to wear this with just a hard leather insole since the insoles that are removable will eventually break down. You guys know, I've said it so frequently, traditional is the way to go. Hard leather will form to your foot and last so much longer. This boot comes in at $660 here at Pete's and of course, Anderson Bean is made in the USA. Now it's time to try this boot on and see how it looks and feels. All right guys, I have on the Anderson Bean Cayman belly boots right now and they feel great. I left the insole in the left foot on this one and I took it out on the right foot just to see the difference and I like it without an insole. Now I am wearing hmm, kind of medium thickness socks. It's not like the thickest sock that I have but it's not the thinnest one either and depending on what you like to wear the most you might have to consider sizing down if you wanted to wear it the traditional way, which is without the insole. So it is a little bit roomy there without the insole, um, but with the insole, it feels like a really good fit. The insole is nice cushion, but uh, like I said, it's, uh, you know, it's not my favorite. I have nothing against the folks who do like the removable insoles and that little extra cushion, but uh, there's nothing like the feel of a boot where you actually wear it in to the point where the imprint of your foot is in that hard leather insole. There's, it's seriously one of the most comfortable feelings ever. The Cayman belly is really supple. It's nice. It's a great quality skin here. Sometimes you can go either way on Cayman. On some brands, they 
might not have the best quality came in, but this is a really nice leather. Here's POV of that toe shape. As you can see, classic Anderson Bean look for sure. This is a classic Anderson Bean boot, guys. Uh, it's got that square toe that they're known for, uh, and this Cayman is so supple, it's awesome. They do have a few areas where they've saved a little bit money and passed that savings on to you with this heel. Uh, it is a bonded leather rather than a true stacked leather, but uh, that's just, that's just a, a nice place to try and save a little bit of money if you are not a complete 100% purist. You know what I'm saying? They do still have a lot of pure 100% cowboy boot things to this boot with the wood pegs in here alongside that shank. You always love to see that and pretty much leather everywhere else on this boot. The insole, that cushion insole, I think I probably would wear it without it uh, because I like the hard leather feeling and I would also consider sizing a half size down because this takes up a lot more room than what I thought it would. Uh, I thought it was gonna be just like a really, really thin piece of foam like what it, what it is down here at the toe, but it does have a lot of cushion at the heel as well. So uh, that takes up a lot of space. And I think that if you prefer the traditional feeling of a hard leather insole that you might want to size down. This Cayman is coming in at $660 here at Pete's, which is a good price for Cayman. I got my first Cayman boot. I had sticker shock when I first got it, but uh, it was completely worth it. I love Cayman so much, so I'm so happy that I got to try this boot on. And the fact that it's made in the USA is also a huge value as well. Thank you so much for watching today. And if you guys are interested in getting this boot, you can call Pete's. Their number is right here. I just put it on the screen and call them, order it. They will ship to you. And even if you're just passing through, by you know stop in it's incredible here they got so many different kinds of boots they got great people they got clothes they got hats it's an awesome store i highly recommend it thank you so much for watching today if you found this video entertaining or educational please consider subscribing it goes a long way to help me continue bringing quick impression videos like this one from great stores like pete's i'll see you around everybody peace you gotta love the look of those ab caymans and America is where they're made in. Pick them up if you're looking for a treat and make sure that you get them from Pete's, yeah. Thanks so much for watching today. Wanted to check out this other quick impression video that I have up here, or I have a music video down there that I think you might enjoy. Please subscribe while you're here too, and I'll see you next time. Peace, have a good one.